the flight directly to Indianapolis. Uh, there were a couple people that were transfers, so I guess they came on an earlier flight and they were staying on that the gate agent didn't see. And then there were three people of Please customer. The automated people mover is approaching the main terminal building. There were when three. When the APM stops, please exit and follow signs to the baggage plane A. Remember, resort and other ground transportation options are on level one. There were three customer of size people, so now I need to go over to the Cincinnati flight on Delta. Hi guys, I made the flight, but I'm really upset because take a tram so hopefully this all goes all in the baggage line first time for everything we're going with it hi guys i'm in the car driving along to indianapolis i actually uh, found a cape spade outlet and i know for a fact that cape spades purses are under warranty for a year and they will fix it for you and if they can't fix it then i think they'll place it so i'm just driving along this is the most strangest commute ever but honestly i'm really glad that i did come this way just because my purse did break i don't know if i would have went to indianapolis directly if i would have gotten on my purse would have broke i don't know this gives me something to do the actual original trip the crew isn't supposed to be in until like 4 30 this afternoon which i don't know if they're even going to get in that early uh because there's a huge snowstorm in minneapolis right now i am going to drive a little bit i've only been on the road for like 10 minutes but um i have to get off this exit in 12 miles and then i think i'm going to see what's around and get something to eat or see if there's a starbucks or something i can stop at because I need a coffee and then um, just gonna be driving and I'll catch up with you guys uh, probably in Indy. Hi everyone, we're still driving. Well actually no, we went to the outlets and I got my new purse. So she's cute, she's the same one that I had before, I just even exchanged it. So I was correct, if they have the purse in stock, they will even exchange it because your purse is under warranty for a year. When I walked in, I was like, my purse broke. She was like, oh my God, that's the saddest thing I've heard all day. I was like, I know, it's really sad. But she did an even exchange, which was great. And then I went to coach at Michael Kors, still didn't see anything. So that's like my second time at an outlet in like a week that I've struck out and seeing anything but that's okay it's not like we really need anything anyway well I did buy a pair of earrings at Kate Spade they're the same earrings I had a while ago they're just like these really big studs and I lost one I was really sad that I lost one so now I bought another pair and so I have three so if I lose one again then I'll have a pair if that makes sense and then we stopped at the Arby's and I had a roast, roast beef sandwich. I just ate the meat, so we're all good there. Got a diet Dr. Pepper because they have Dr. Pepper at Arby's. Delish. So now we're on our way to Indianapolis. We actually stay kind of far away from the airport. It says I'll be there in 34 minutes. I hope they have a hotel shuttle because I have to return this bad boy. But it's really cold here, it's like 28 degrees, I'm freezing. But, like I said, there's a snowstorm going on in Minnesota, so thank God it's not snowing here, that's all I have to say. All right, well, I will check in with you guys when I get to the uh, hotel. Hotel room tour. We have a nice little sweet living room area. 
a nice desk, hardwood floors throughout. We love that. A nice little wet bar with a fridge and a microwave. And then the bathroom, it's very clean and sleek. And I think this does this. Oh wait, no, how does this work? Maybe this, there we go. Ah, isn't that so cool? And then the bedroom, which is this nice, I love the hardwood floors. A nice big king bed and a pretty view of a building. <laughs> You guys so i made it to indy um i am going to get situated get my stuff together and then i am going to try and find like a kroger or a target or something like that so i can get some snacks because i haven't done that yet for my trip and i knew there was a slight chance i was possibly renting a car today last night when i was planning my uh how to get to indianapolis for work um i was planning on renting a car anyway so I think what I'll do is get some snacks and everything from a grocery store and then I will come back oh there's a closet over here my ADD just saw this there's a closet with a safe because you know you want to be safe with your items um anyway I think that yeah that's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna get gas for the car well I'm gonna go to the grocery store or find a target or something then I'm gonna get gas go to the airport and then come back they do at this hotel have a weekly weeknight reception they have the apps and then the like free drinks or whatever um from 5 30 to 7 30 so i may partake in that we will see how tired i am or not i believe our van's going to be at 5 30 not really sure the crew is going to let us know um when they get here because another girl commutes i think she commutes from st louis so uh she's coming in a little later and we need to know what time the van is so anyway that was a lot and i'm gonna go hi guys uh running a little late this morning it's 5 27 and our van's at 5 30 so i have to go i got everything okay let me switch this really quick everyone doing today i hope you're having a great day um we are doing wait did i get my phone on yeah i got my phone um we are going to liberia today but it's crazy weather outside it's rainy sleety everything is happening outside right now so i don't know if we're gonna be a little late or not I got all my groceries from yesterday. Oh, I totally didn't show you guys. Crap, totally forgot. Huh? <laughs> Running late sucks. 